you again. Um, I'm in my newest, uh, newest project. It's my second uh, flip property that I have uh, shown you guys or hinted in the previous videos. Um, so I'm standing what is going to be a living room. As you see, there's a fireplace behind me. Um, so what I'm going to do with this series is I'm going to record from start um, throughout the process, uh, repairs, um, and then at the end, the final, the final edition, uh, everything after everything is done, the sale price, uh, and I hope you join me and you enjoy, um, enjoy this, the video series, if you want to call it. Uh, so a little bit about this house, guys. Uh, it is a little bit bigger than the last one. Um, if you watched my previous video, uh, the first house that I did, um, this one is four bedroom, two and a half baths. Uh, it does have a it does have a basement, but also has a pool, uh, which we didn't have on the last house. So, so that that's gonna be one thing that uh, I'm gonna have to deal with on this one. So, um, so again, um, I would like to go through the house, show you where we are right now, um, and what what I'm planning on doing with it. So, so give you a little bit of an overview. Uh, what I got myself into uh, over the next four months um, and then and then so we can compare um, towards the end of did, did we do everything that I wanted to do did I make some changes and what so forth um, a little bit on this house itself uh, so I bought it for 175 uh, we are hoping to put about 30 grand in it 35 max and uh, it comes about 2 to 75 so if, if everything goes um, it, it should be a pretty pretty decent return so guys this is the outside um, so as you see it's really quite a neighborhood so right now um, that we're, we're getting rid of all the stuff um, so it's pretty much demolition going on um, so it's a two-car garage uh, wood siding with some brick on the front uh, going into the main door so as you see so this is going to be replaced by tile or hardwood uh, we stripped the carpet out completely all the way down to the wood so this is going to be a formal living room slash dining room uh, so on this one we're probably going to paint we have to re redo the paint redo the ceilings light fixtures um, and again carpet uh, so we took all the doors off all the way down to the frames so we're putting all brand new doors. The entrance door will be painted to match the exterior and interior. Um, going into, so this house um, has, has a fireplace, as you saw in the beginning, uh, in the background. Um, we'll probably, I'm still out trying to debate what we're gonna do with this. Um, Take, take the fan leave it because right now there's nothing hooked up to it uh, we have removed some cabinets here already to give it a straight straight wall so we'll have to mud it and sheet rock it and then paint it but so this is going to be the living room uh, again we're going to have to paint the interior ceilings whatnot uh, we are removing plan is to remove this beam the center beam so we'll open this kitchen up and we'll also cut this section that section so it will be an open 
it's gonna it's gonna flow to the other side, this, the countertop. So it's gonna be one sense continuous countertop. So it won't have the wall, uh, which will open that. Um, as you see, the kitchen pretty much we're gonna put new new tops, new appliances gonna go in. Microwave has been out. Um, the the stove is out. The dishwasher is out. Um, so again. Uh, we're gonna paint. Uh, we're in the process of removing the deck. So as you see, here's the pool. It's deteriorated to the point that it won't be able to salvage. But I will come to that later. Later in this video. So let's go to the bedrooms, guys. So the three bedrooms are upstairs. So. So as you go here, you have two on the left, one on the right, and one on the right is the master. You also have a bath coming into here. So this is the first bath. And yeah, there's no light. So there's no light, guys, but this is the bath. So it does have a tub in there. So we're going to pretty much same thing. Put new flooring, uh, new on uh, Paint the walls, paint the ceilings. Um, here again, so now we're going back into one of the rooms. This is the first room. Again, so again, we removed all the carpet, everything in this one. Uh, same thing. We're going to paint it, ceiling, new light fixtures. New light fixtures to replace these. Uh, so it's it's pretty pretty decent project, guys. Uh, from from start to finish, and I think, as I said, I think I mentioned it. Um, the the time frame for this is four months, because um, I did have to. I did a, I did a mortgage investment mortgage loan. Um, so I, I, if you again, if you followed my last video, uh, the last house I had to hold for six months. This one I have to hold for four. Uh, because it, it's a different bank that it goes to, so they don't require it holding for six months. Um, so this will put us about February, March time frame when we can put it back on the market. Um, so the windows, we're going to paint the frames on each and every one. We're not going to replace the windows, guys, because um, these are still pretty, I mean, pretty decent shape. So nothing, nothing wrong. So there's no way, there's no reason to replace these. Um, so gone again to so this is the master on this one we're getting rid of the popcorn ceiling it does have vaulted ceiling we're going to again replace the fan put a brand new fan in new lights uh, the whole nine yards uh, carpet or wood hardwood whichever uh, so it does have a closet um, then going here this is going to be the master bath and here's the mass oh yeah here's the other section of the master bath so we're gonna put a countertop here with two sinks um, and like I said we're gonna put new flooring here remove this stone pattern vinyl um, and like I said repaint make it all nice and neat all brand spanking new so these are the three now we are going to the fourth one so the fourth one is on the second level again we are going up here so this is this is pretty decent size room guys it's just it's in the attic somewhat uh, but it's pretty pretty long and so again ceilings are going to be gone uh, wood wood flooring probably um, here's a walk-in closet for this room um, like I said again paint new paint um, pretty much throughout the house um, I think we're still debating of what we're gonna do with these railings if we're gonna repaint them or if we're gonna completely replace them 
Um, so that's that's still up in the air. If you want, you can comment and let me know what you guys, what would you guys do? So um, I would I would love to hear. See see the comments. So now we're going to the garage level, and which leads to the basement. So here is the garage. Um, two car. Uh, here's your wash. So here's the wash and dryer room. Again, popcorn gone. New paint. New floor. New lights. Now going to the basement. So you can comment out on this again, guys. Have you ever seen a wallpaper out of newspaper or depicting newspapers? So that is the half bath gone again. So this is the this is the basement, guys. So pretty much. Um, this is going to look completely different because we're going to get rid of all this wood panels. It's going to be all one sheet rock. Uh, it's going to get painted. Uh, we're putting carpets down here. Uh, so it's going to look nice and neat. This island, we're going to put granite countertops. Uh, paint it. Uh, we're still debating what to do with that. Since there's a pipe inside, we don't know if we want to tear it up or not. But, so this is, that's the plan for the basement. And then here is the storage facility or storage room. So, so here we're just gonna paint the walls and that's pretty much it. Now, I am gonna go introduce you to the outside of the house, which is the pool area that I showed you earlier today, guys. Uh, So uh, I'm turning off all the lights as I'm going out as well. Uh, so let's go outside. So for the outside guys, um, we're going to have to pretty much repaint the whole house. What is that? Okay, there's a hole. Oh, okay. So repaint the whole house. Top to bottom, replace wood rot if there's any. Um, on the other side there is. So that should be interesting. But yeah, so it's going to be... Uh, I'm, I'm gonna leave that for next. I don't know yet which color it's gonna be. So I'm not gonna suggest that. So here is the pool, guys, that you've shown, that you've seen from the outside. Um, sorry, from the inside of the house. So pretty much the plan is um, to cover this up because it is not worth fixing. Uh, it's gonna cost a lot more than what I expected it to. To put it to put it back in its primes so so we're gonna get rid of the deck put this cover it and then put topsoil on top guys so so it's gonna be just one big yard uh, we have removed that panel section of the fence to open that up because um, it went as you see it went around the pool area so now we've gained this area as well to the yard so that is pretty much uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the tour of the new my new investment property um, so if I haven't said in the beginning please uh, subscribe if you like what you see, please comment, let me know what you think, um, you know, what, with, 
if, if you might be doing something different than I'm doing, uh, let me know. And so the plan for this, for the next four months is to create a video every two to three weeks, show progress, what we're doing, uh, if anything changed, as I said, and then have, have the final product at the end and then list it and see, see how we did. So again, please subscribe so you don't miss any of the videos. Um, so that will be that. Um, also, piece of advice is if you do want to do something like this, because as you see, um, it's about probably six o'clock now. It's, it's, it's about 13 hours. Because um, as you see, I'm still in my work clothes, guys. So pretty much I went to work um, and came here after and um, to kind of see what, you know, wh where we are, what's, what's going on. So, and so I'm probably going to be doing that here quite often for the next four months. So I just prepared to do that because um, it's, even though even, I even, even, me having a project manager, I still have to make sure everything is going the way it is. Um, so especially if you're doing something on your own, uh, just prepare for long hours. Uh, but at the end of the day, as you saw in my first flip, uh, it is worth it. And I'm hoping that this one will be worth it as well. So again, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, like I said, again, hit the su subscribe button. Um, so you get notified for all the upcoming videos and then um, again I will make another video in about two to three weeks. Thank you guys.